Hey everyone, as you can see, there are some amazingly creative yes. Halloween costumes yes. up here on the stage as part of the Kitty Costume Contest at the Miracle Theater, just one of the many fun festivities happening for Halloween in Coral Gables. It was a family affair on Halloween evening as hundreds showed up as their favorite characters for the 17th annual Halloween on the Mile celebrations. Downtown Coral Gables had something for everyone from good old trick-or-treating to a fun photo booth, scary story time, and costume contests for both the kids and the family dog. The Business Improvement District for Coral Gables, as you know, is a marketing and advertising agency for downtown Coral Gables. And it is our pleasure, you know, to put in all these festivities. Today, as you can see, we're celebrating Halloween on the Mile. We're on our 17th year, and every year it, gets, it keeps getting bigger and better. Um, this year we've had a photo booth over at Lake Astor, which was amazing. We had a kid costume contest over at the Actors Playhouse. We had amazing participation, and today we're here at the Coral Gables Museum for the Pooch uh, costume contest. And last but not least, have everybody stop by Books and Books, where we have reading for all the kids. And these are just a few of the different things. Also, the bid um, purchases all the candy for like starter packages for all the merchants. You know what, so we can invite everybody to come out and enjoy a family day at the mile. We're so thrilled to be part of this exciting event every year. We have wonderful families coming in here, kids all dressed up, families dressed up to match the costume attire, and they parade on stage, and they're all so great about auditioning and prancing themselves up there. Some terrific prizes to inspire them. And then look what else, they're getting candy all up and down the mile, a dog contest, just a lot of fun. So that's Halloween on the mile. We were asked by uh, the bid to pick out a storyteller, so we picked out Mirtha Mueller, who's actually a fifth grade teacher at a school nearby, so she decided to offer her services and be the Wicked Witch of the West. So we have the witch's lair going on in the uh, kids' room right now, so she's taken over. We teamed with the Business Improvement District and Halloween on the Mile thinking it would be fun to do something here on the plaza in conjunction with the celebration. So everybody loves dogs and costumes, so we thought let's do a doggy costume contest and it's been super popular. We want to make the dogs feel special and their owners, so we do the, the red carpet walk. We have four judges. It's just a great, fun event and here we are. All of the proceeds from the doggy costume contest directly benefit the Humane Society of Greater Miami. Well, there was definitely something for everyone this Halloween, including kids, families, parents, dogs, and their owners. For Coral Gables TV, I'm Brianna Moles.